Following Friday's vote in the Senate, which killed any hopes of Democrats bolstering their weak case with new witnesses, CNN's chief legal analyst Jeffrey Tubin was asked to share his thoughts on what the vote meant in the big impeachment picture. Tubin declared, Trump won. I mean, you know, he's going to win this trial. If Tubin is throwing in the towel, you can be sure Democratic morale has reached an all time low. Tubin didn't even complain about the whiteness of the president's legal defenders this time. Tubin continued, He won on the issue of witnesses, he's gonna get acquitted, and that is how history will remember what went on here. Tubin then said he thought history will also record that there were other pivotal witnesses who were available to the House of Representatives, before quickly correcting himself to the Senate, but Tubin was right the first time. History should record that House Democrats failed to build a strong case in their rush to impeach the president and abandoned legal challenges to enforce subpoenas to gather new evidence and call other witnesses. The final Senate vote to call new witnesses was defeated 49 51. Two Republican senators joined with the Democrats, Susan Collins of Maine and Mitt Romney of Utah. But Senators Lisa Murkowski of Alaska and Lamar Alexander of Tennessee stayed faithful to McConnell's majority. After voting on witnesses, the Senate is now adjourned until 11 a.m. Eastern Time on Monday, when both sides will have two hours to make closing arguments. With the President's State of the Union address set for Tuesday, the Senate trial will reconvene on Wednesday at 4 p.m. Eastern Time to vote on a final verdict for the President. Senators will likely make floor speeches in the days leading up to final vote.